Hi, my name is Liz Kane. I'll be your Seiko Fellow for this evening. I want to say thank you to Yvette for agreeing to host today. And um, I have to add that she was one of my style icons when I was a little girl. And so it's kind of full circle and fun how things are um, <laughs> kind of working out like this. Um, so thank you for joining us. I uh, Secondly, I want to say why I'm here. Um, so I watched a documentary on Amazon Prime called The True Cost. And it uh, goes into um, basically what clothing manufacturers are doing worldwide that are against um, Seiko ethics. So let me backtrack. So Seiko's mission is to ethically employ women in underdeveloped countries so they can attend university. Uh, a fact, a scary fact, is that only 2% of garments made worldwide are made ethically. Uh, and 74% of those workers are women. Uh, Seiko is proud to have joined the Prana Coalition of Ethical and Sustainable uh, Retailers. Um, our leather is uh, ethically and humanely uh, sourced. It's handcrafted from small batches, oil tanned, um, sheepskin or cowhide leather. I'm going to try to keep this as short and sweet as possible. I know we're all uh, working moms, uh, wives, business owners, and we don't have a ton of time to be spending. So I apologize if I'm running through this really quickly. My goal is to have this done in 20 minutes. Um, if we get to 30, I'm not going to be mad at that. I just don't want to go over 30. So if I could just apologize if I'm speaking fast or uh, running through anything quickly. If you do have any questions, please, by all means, I want this to be an open dialogue. If you have any concerns, um, Okay, so Yvette's saying some of her friends and family uh, don't have Facebook and can't log on. Uh, we'll do our best to share this video with them uh, somehow, whether we end up uh, emailing or texting, um, but we'll figure this out. <laughs> uh, the party will remain open uh, for at least a week. Uh, we want to get it closed by the 24th. There is a, a deal right now that hostesses can earn an additional $50 in Seiko credit. Um, a hostess already earns $50 in credit if her party or his party brings in uh, 300 or more dollars in sales. Um, so uh, a party could potentially, if closed by the 24th of April, could uh, earn a hostess $100 in Seiko credit. So uh, that's really exciting, right? Um, so uh, yeah, so let's just get into the products. Um, I'm all about thrifting. So earlier this year when my neighbor told me about the Amazon documentary called The True Cost, um, it convinced me to start only buying secondhand clothing. Um, so when I got invited to a Seiko party uh, last month, I was like, here we go again, another MLM. I'm not sure if you guys feel the same way, but um, just not into it. Uh, most of the time I ignore them, but this one really caught my attention because it talked about um, employing women ethically and um, producing garments uh, that aren't going to pollute our planet. and um, sourcing leather hum in a humane fashion. So that's that was important to me. Um, the price point was a bit high for me personally. Like I said, I have been trained to thrift or buy secondhand. Um, but the cool thing about Seiko products is um, in a way they're secondhand because a lot of them are up uh, upsourced or uh, recycled products. So the uh, chiffon is actually made from recycled water bottles. So that's really cool. So uh, let's start with the products. Um, my first product that I'll be showing tonight is the uh, Kawa Slash Agave Print Maxi Skirt. So um, not sure if you can forgive me. I'm in my son's room. I'm a mom. I really didn't have time to be making a pretty studio or anything, so I'm just making use with what I got. Um, so it hits me, I'm five foot three, I'm wearing it in a high waist fashion, and it hits me uh, just above the ankle, um, mid, uh, mid calf. 
So um, you can wear it, you know, I've seen some women wear it folded down right here so that you're showing off that beautiful agave color. Um, you can completely reverse it. I am wearing pants underneath. <laughs> and um, wear it with the green out. Um, so that's exciting. Um, I love this color because it pairs well with, um, with not only, uh, you know, neutral shades, uh, like, you know, this type of color, um, but also like a color pop, you know, this is my bathing suit. I'm not going to put this on for you, but, uh, I, well, the cut, the lighting isn't super great. Um, I put up some stock photos in the feed so you can take a look at it there. And then of course there's the catalog. Um, Paired with a blazer, um, this is not a Seiko product, but um, this feels very professional, and um, I feel really good in uh, this skirt with uh, a tank or and a blazer. Um, the second thing that I want to show you uh, is the multi-way, um, also the same print as the first. Um, material that was shown uh, with the maxi skirt. This is the uh, multi-way shawl. So you can easily uh, wear this as a bathing suit cover-up, um, just as a, I don't know, as a cardigan almost. Um, there is a button right here if you want to wear it like this. Oftentimes I'll wear it back uh, with just um, with a pair of high-waisted jeans and maybe just like a little uh, crop top. And it just feels really flowy and comfy. Um, it's it's a great piece. This actually came in the starter kit that was $149. Um, I was shocked when I heard that because uh, $120 is the cost of the bag, which I was gonna get anyway, this beautiful leather sheepskin crossbody. Um, and then for $20 more, I was going to get this multi-way shawl, not to mention the Seiko ribbon sandals, which I'm going to put those on for you because some people um, are nervous. They're not as coordinated as others, and I'm one of those individuals who isn't very coordinated. Um, so it comes already, they come already laced, and... Um, the starter kit even came with these beautiful chiffon ribbons, and I'll show you how easy it is to uh, exchange the two as well. Um, so not only is this a beautiful leather sandal, um, but it, I was nervous about a flat sandal because I have plantar fasciitis, so I didn't know what kind of support I was gonna get. Um, these are excellently made shoes. Um, they remind me of a, of a Birkenstock, which was recommended for someone with plantar fasciitis. So you simply just uh, s slip your foot in that way. And then, um, so then you go the back, forward, and back again, and you're done. And they're really comfortable. I was nervous about uh, changing out the ribbons easily just take it out there. Um, first it goes through the top. Each side goes through the first set, the first pair, I suppose you could say. And then these cross over once. And then they go through the second set of loops. Once you've got them laced, oops, that went, <laughs> that went around the back. Once you've got them laced, you just kind of loosen, loosen. Your foot slips through here. Your toes go in through this top one here. Gosh, I hope you can't tell I didn't wax my legs. <laughs> I'm glad it's only women. <laughs> and then again, through the back, over the, the top, and tie. It's that simple. I personally um, prefer the, the um, chiffon ribbons because they're just softer, but I like the look of the black. <laughs> so I, I go back and forth. I do want to get some more. Um, so next, 
I want to go into a little more detail about how the uh, multi-way shawl can be worn multi-ways. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to remove this um, business top. I'm wearing my little Spanx. <laughs> um, Spanx uh, tank top. So to wear it backwards, you just button the little button here. Place it over your head, put your arm through the hole, and you can almost wear it as a caftan. So this is kind of cute with the open back, right? Um, you can also, if you like a cinched waist, you can, I wore it like this to brunch the other day, felt really vacation-y. I felt like I was definitely, even though I was in downtown LA, I, I definitely felt like I was on vacation. <laughs> I had my Seiko bracelet, with all, which also came in my um, starter kit for only $150. Um, came with the cute little pieces. I bought my friend uh, one for her birthday, uh, the gratitude set. They came with the bracelet and then two pieces. And then I bought her the feminine um, piece, which was a piece of rose quartz. It's so beautiful. I'll post a picture of that as well. But I, I love the way this looks. This just feels really, uh, the back kind of always have to adjust the back a little bit, but I don't know, I just, there's something about this look that really makes me feel like I'm on vacation and I'm just like living my best life. <laughs> um, another piece that I'm in awe of, oh, I didn't even show you how you can wear it as a maternity top. Sorry, I just learned this literally last night and I am just over the moon. So this piece is a perfect new mom gift. This is why not only when you tie it, so pretend I have a big belly bump. I mean, I kind of do because I put on 10 pounds during quarantine. Um, <laughs> but the, when you tie it right here, it just perfectly, uh, I have to show you a picture of um, Liz Bohan and it's funny, her name's also Liz, but she actually, it looks nice like this, right? That's another way you can wear it just like this. Um, but, uh, she's pregnant right now, like nine months pregnant. I think she's due this month and she was featuring the summer capsule collection, which launched yesterday and her baby bump just, it was just so magically like presented amongst this like flowy fabric. And she was wearing the new, uh, purple poppy print and she just, she looked like a queen. I mean, I just, just, she was just radiating, just pure motherhood joy it was it was really beautiful and then she was like well once you have you have the baby you no longer have the bump well guess what this is a breastfeeding uh cover-up it's very lightweight it's really silky it's a perfect stroller cover when you're going on walks with the baby I this would have been i would have been over the moon to get this when i was pregnant personally um so the next thing i want to show you is the duster terracotta duster wasn't sure about this product until i put it on i got it for free actually in the month of uh march becoming a seiko fellow they just like sent this to me and i was like well thank you very much you know i'm not going to turn it away as soon as i opened it i was like mm, i don't know i don't know but then i put it on and this is i've never i shamefully i've never worn organic cotton before um and in the documentary the two Co true cost how are we doing on time i just want to make sure i'm not going over okay 7 16. i'm gonna to try to wrap it up um organic cotton is so luxurious um and this is just such such a nice piece just for lounging i don't know i i just feel expensive in it i feel really beautiful in it so i've been wearing this like crazy um, and also it goes with great with the new hat that I bought when I was in, um, <laughs> that's another thing when I bought in Solvang a couple of weeks ago. So not going to lie. This is a really great little thing that Seiko just was like, thanks for becoming a fellow. And I was like, thank you. <laughs> um, so last but not least, this was a splurge for me, the black maxi dress. So forgive me, but I have to show you how this works. This is so much fun. So my favorite, I think the sexiest way to wear this maxi dress is by wearing it with the elastic in the front 
and then by pulling it front here, doing a little tie. Now, this is gonna look really good on somebody with less of a robust bust. <laughs> I'll just put it that way. Um, I, <laughs> I don't know, I, I know Yvette knows my family, but my, uh, my grandmother, uh, Agnes Henning, yeah, all of the girls in her family, um, we got that side of her. So <laughs> so when I wear this, it's, it's a bit revealing when I wear it like this, but oh my gosh, is this not super sexy? So this is, I think, this is what got me to buy it. And I don't know. I mean, obviously, I wouldn't wear it with a with a Spanx tank top underneath, but this just looks. I just oh, oh. <laughs> you guys understand. Um, so this is the way that that sold me. Then there's the classic way, where you just kind of do a wrap bandage or a bandage wrap. I'm not sure. I haven't quite perfected it. I just got it, and then you tie it in the back this so there's this kind of look and then of course the back is open um, the next look would be uh, oh you can pull it up over like this oh I didn't even talk about the fact that it has pockets this is amazing so yeah this is another actually this would be a good maternity um, piece probably um, haven't quite perfected wearing it like this but if you pull it up, it's just kind of like a, a mid-length uh, maxi, it wouldn't be a maxi dress, I guess it would be a mid-length mid dress. I'm not into fashion like you are, Yvette, so you'll have to teach me a few things. Um, so then turning it around gives it a whole nother look, of course. Um, pulling it back down so that it's the maxi uh, long way. Pulling this up here, you've got a... Um, a dress with a beautiful tie in the back. Um, I'm not going to tie it because I'm not as coordinated in the back. Um, what are some other ways? I'm like spacing, of course, but there's a video um, that shows everything. So I'm just going to keep it like this. But um, yeah, so that's the maxi uh, dress. And uh, this I couldn't not buy. Um, it's technically last season's uh, dress. So, you know, and it's not fast fashion what we do with at Seco. So once they're gone, they're gone. Uh, occasionally they'll bring pieces back. Apparently the purple poppy print, they did something similar and Liz Bohannon just loved it so much she had to bring it back. But um, so th those are the clothing pieces that I have. Oh, I didn't even talk about the bag. So I'll, I'll just touch on the bag um, and then we'll go ahead and close out. Um, so it comes with removable, this removable strap. So it's it's called the crossbody, um, black crossbody clutch, foldover clutch, black crossbody foldover clutch. Um, so you can of course use it as a clutch going out, um, or the way that I prefer to use it is um, is as the crossbody. Uh, I I love a crossbody. Uh, I don't know how I didn't, um, sorry, occasionally I struggle with getting the loops in. There we go. I don't know why. But um, I always did a handbag, and then I don't know if it's just they weren't as popular in the early 2000s when I first became a working professional, but I just, I love this crossbody. It's got the zipper here. It's got two pockets for your phone or lip gloss or hand sanitizer. Um, fits a wallet, my mask, of course. Um, and then it's got this snap closure on the side. Great bag. Perfectly sized. It fits my son's iPad when we go out to dinner. <laughs> I jokingly call uh, our second babysitter. Um, so yeah, don't mind my uh, Spanx <laughs> tank top. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Um, hopefully I didn't do Seiko too badly uh, <laughs> displaying their products. Um, last but not least, I want to end on Seiko's coffee. I am obsessed. Um, uh, the flavors are so rich. Um, 
not to mention, you know, the coffee beans are ethically sourced, they're shade grown. Um, what are my little notes here? Uh, oh, they adhere to the Rainforest Alliance Protocol. So, um, you know, we're ensuring that we're preserving the rainforest. Um, and uh, the decaf coffee uh, is made using the spring water method. So uh, the product is preserved. I'm gonna go ahead and cut it, clo uh, close it, cut it short. Uh, thank you so much for attending. I hope uh, this was fun. Keep commenting and um, asking if you have any questions. Um, we're gonna do a raffle before the, the party closes and um, Yvette will ultimately be that final decision maker as to who gets it. But uh, I made a lot of comments like you can get double raffle tickets if you post pictures of yourself. Um, the more you comment, the more you like, the more of a chance that you have. Um, <laughs> if, <laughs> she just sent me a text. All her sisters want the maxi dress. It's a really fun piece and it's beautiful and classy and sexy all at the same time. So thanks for joining me. Good night.